y'all think? Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So as you can tell by like me smirking, I am super excited for this video. I've been talking about this specific video for about a couple of weeks now in my previous videos and I'm super excited. Today is finally the day that I get to record this. So as you can tell by the title I am doing, is it an outfit or is she just skinny? Ooh. This video has been a trend not only on TikTok, but it has made its way over to YouTube. And as you know, as a YouTuber who loves fashion, I just had to try this video out. Without further ado, I'm gonna stop rambling. Before we actually get into the video, if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, comment which one is your favorite look, and share the scene whether you see your grandma, your auntie, your cousin. But I'm gonna put a timestamp right here. So if you don't wanna hear kind of where this video kind of originated from, what's the T like on the video or on the kind of topic of the video, you can skip to this part right here. I won't be mad at you. Yes, I will. But I advise you to watch the whole thing just because, you know, you're getting the reason why I'm doing this video. I'm not here to bash and I'm not here to talk down on anybody's size, figure, shape, but it's something we need to talk about. It's Especially something in the fashion community it is something we need to talk about so if you want to skip go ahead but i'm going to get into why i decided to do this video so the people that stay y'all have a special place in my heart so let's go ahead and talk about what really started this trend or this type of video to circulate so there was a tweet and i'm going to post a tweet over here every picture that you will need to see is kind of over here but there was a tweet that went out and it was about two plus size women and they had on kind of like a oversized tee with some bermuda shorts and it went viral on twitter and the tweet got over i think 200k likes and people was basically making fun of them so there was this girl and you can see her twitter name if you want to go look at the tweet you can but there was this girl and she basically put them in their place she put them on blast she said she finds it funny how they're making fun of them but if Bella Hadid would have put this on then it would have been a whole bunch of 80s inspo outfit or you know it would have been on everybody's Pinterest board etc etc and I really feel what she's saying like these big celebrities were like nothing and then they're on everybody's Pinterest boards oh it's so trendy oh this is inspiration sis has on a t-shirt and shorts what is she do? like you know what i'm saying that was pretty much that and the crazy part is Gigi hadid and i'm gonna post that screenshot over here Gigi hadid had on some bermuda shorts and a kind of a grayish kind of tee top or whatever and stylecaster posted it i guess on their website it was like she made bermuda shorts cooler and it's just like Now, sis, but if it's the plus size girls wearing it, then they get talked about, they get bashed. And one thing that the girl who originally made the tweet said that kind of stuck with me is that fashion is judged exclusively by the body types that wear it. Like not necessarily on the fashion, but on the body types. So saying basically the body sells the clothes. And that's kind of how it's been for years. I already have my kind of opinions on it. Like I feel like some stuff may be a little overhyped. Like I do think that some of these celebrities can dress. Of course, some of them have stylists and just have a good sense of fashion. You know, they are always surrounded by fashion, but it's the things that the media points out that it's just like, like kind of regular and it's just like but sis had this on and you didn't say anything plus size sis had this on and you didn't say anything but sis over here had it on and now she's getting praised for it so that's just kind of my tea my spill on it but without further ado let's get into these looks okay guys so the first person we have is bella hadid and i'm gonna step back so you all can see the vibes and of course the picture is going to be up on the screen so What's this giving? Like, okay, let's talk about her look first and then we're gonna get into mine. So she had on a black two-piece set, some low rise baggy jeans, shoestring belt, head scarf, some gold jewelry, and a black Dior bag. Mine is not Dior, I just pointed the bag. But you know, mine's not Dior. And some forces. And this is probably one of my favorite looks out of this whole like video. I'm not gonna lie, it's a look to me. What y'all think? But if I saw somebody at the beach and they had this on, 
sis where did she get it from so i feel like with this type of look it depends on what body shape you have if it looks right or not because i am plus size i am a size 16 to 18 so i am plus size and to me i feel like this looks pretty good the only thing is i do not like low rise jeans i just feel like let's leave that back in the 2000s where it belong let's not bring it in 2020 2021 period overall to me it's the look and i feel like if you have the right body type this will look cute but this swimsuit is from shein scarf and beauty supply store bag nine west pants are thrifted these shoestrings came from my vans and then of course my forces and it's a look period all right guys so the next person we have is miss emma chamberlain i just want to say i love emma she's just so gorgeous to me like naturally beautiful beautiful with makeup period you know what i'm saying so getting into her look so she has on a nude crop top and some dark brown trousers kind of flare out trousers at the bottom and then she has on some heels and the heels are kind of like the wide chunky heel but i did want to show you all these heels i did get these from ego shoes this isn't sponsored i paid with this with my own money so i just wanted to let you all see the shoes just in case when i show you all the full view you all don't really see the shoes but these are the shoes that i do have one it's kind of the same not really the same but you know you'll get the idea of the fit okay so this is the full outfit and it's okay it's not my favorite i feel like this is kind of one of those outfits i didn't really execute to the t like i could have it's giving you the idea on a plus size person so i do have my new crop top from pretty little things these are from shein these suck so bad and then like i said the shoes are from ego and i just feel like i don't like the heels with the fit but on her i like the heels because it's more of like a dressier look versus this just kind of gives me like chill and then like what are those what do you guys think is it a look i feel like it's an outfit on her i don't know because not only like closer up it's like maybe it's outfit on me too personally on me just how i styled it i just don't feel like it's the it's the best outfit it's still an outfit but it could be better. And I feel like on her, I love how her is kind of more dressy. Like the crop top she had on was like covered up at the front. It was just, it just gave more dressy vibes versus this, it's giving more casual. Overall, I give it a look like it's an outfit, just not how I styled it on me personally. Okay, so next we have Miss Gigi Hadid. And this is the style Miss Gigi had on. So Gigi had on a green trench coat with a button down it's like a button down that stops kind of midway but a button down top and she has on some blue jeans with like this line detail in the middle and i don't know if the shoes are loafers they look like loafers but i don't know if they're loafers or not and then she has on like this white bag cute outfit but let's talk about me let's talk about me okay because period like y'all ever feel like y'all just steal the show but like on accident it's not on purpose it's on accident that's how i feel to me it's an outfit but it's not anything i would be like oh my gosh it's Gigi Hadid and she's rocking no it's not like that it's it's just like oh look look at Gigi look at Gigi like but this is like oh my god there goes Shanice and she's rocking that <laughs> i'm gonna say on her and no offense to Gigi, I love Gigi. On her, it's just giving me like, just regular vibes. Like, on me, it's giving brunch. Oh, I have a meeting. You said something? Like, it's giving vibes. Without the shoes. The shoes are terrible. Blazer is thrifted. Pants are from Forever 21. They have the line detailing, period. Okay, we're coming with the details. This is from Shein. Shein. Oh, and the shoes are from Burlington but period okay this is really cute it's really giving i really don't have anything negative to say it's cute it's just a normal everyday outfit nothing to overhype about you know it's just an outfit so okay so next person we have is miss kendall jenner um this is the outfit now she has on it's like a flint it looks like a flannel like an oversized flannel oversized white tee tucked into the pants some jeans some forces a bag and some black shades and of course the keys covering the face so i'm gonna get into my outfit 
What is it giving? The outfit isn't giving. So when I did this video, of course I did my research. I do my research on all my videos. Basically on every look, I looked up off duty model looks for that particular person and i kind of already had the people i was going to do just because i know the people who the blog sites kind of rave and go crazy over so that's kind of who i picked and kendall jenner i want to say she's more like me just just not this outfit because her style is very chill and that's really me like 99 percent of the time but then at one percent you're gonna get like you know bad chick i don't know it's just not for me I just look so basic. Unfortunately, this is not an outfit. We love Kendall, but this isn't it. So the next person, or the last person, the last person we have is Miss Haley Bieber. And I gotta say, sis eight, period. So just did what she had to do. And I'm not even upset about it. I'm not even upset. So in her look, she had on a leather jacket, white t-shirt dress, some white boots, and a black bag, period. Black shades, and that was pretty much the outfit. So I'm gonna show you guys my outfit. All right, so this is my outfit. This is just kind of how I paired it. Unfortunately, I don't have the white boots, but overall, I still feel like the outfit is pretty much a match. Boots from Shein, dress from Shein. It's actually a top. Jacket from Shein, purse Shein, shade Shein. This is not Shein sponsored. But overall, this is cute. Um, The dress, very short. It's actually a shirt. So the shirt, very short. This is the design in the back. I just wanna know how she wore this and wasn't nervous. Cause right now I'm just making sure we keeping this PG-13. Overall, this is a cute look. I mean, I feel like it's still a look without the shoes being not what she had on. It's still a look to me. I'm definitely gonna be posting this on my Instagram, not this, but just this up part, you'll see. So make sure you go and follow me on my Instagram and my other socials, it'd be down below in the description box. So make sure you follow me on my socials just to see some of these looks because some of these will be on my Instagram. But overall, this is an outfit, love it. I don't really have any complaints. It's an outfit. So that is pretty much all the outfits that I have today. This video is super fun, I love this kind of video if you want to see me do more of content like this then make sure you comment that down below in the comment section and i will definitely do that because this is like so much fun like i just i can't right now so overall my thoughts on this video it was not only to test the practicality of the outfits but also to test if the outfits are trendy are they stylish are they worth the hype that they get from not only bloggers and you know different social media sites but from us as normal people some were some were not but overall my thoughts on the whole situation wear whatever you want to wear no one should be bashing anyone for what they wear because you don't buy their clothes and they don't buy yours so keep your comments to yourself if they're not positive and on that note that's all i gotta say period i hope you all enjoyed it don't forget to like comment and subscribe and like always i love you guys and i'll see you guys next time bye I got cash on me, on she gon' spaz on me, on me. Let me take this flight, I got gas on me.